all right guys welcome back to planter garden tv today we're doing herb sort we're searching for herbs a lot of them i really don't know their names but i'm sure that someone might be able to identify these herbs for me as you see the beauty of this one the beautiful colors this one I usually use this one dried. I also use the roots and I boil the roots and I drink the roots. But not telling you to do that. I'm just showing you. This is about me. All right. This is another beautiful one here as well. That I don't know the name of it, but I know it's a home. I know it's a home. The beautiful flowers. All right. So this is what's going on. We're searching for herbs today. We're trying to identify different herbs, okay? So, so far we see two. This one, this is leather skin. This is one that grows some berries, all right? Okay, so we're gonna move on and we're gonna continue searching for herbs, all right? All right, this is the rua plan. R-U-E. In other places, they call it ruta. This is another herb. It's also a scrub that you could plant by the bank side. It produces a beautiful yellow flowers. But this is what you call ruta. Beautiful herb and it's cold hardy as well. It comes back every year. The scent of it is really strong. But it's a beautiful herb, man. When you smell it, it's... The smell of it tells you this is something. This got to be something. So check this out as well, guys. So we're going to move on to more herbs. All right, this, this is what you call bitter duck. Bitter duck is cold hardy. I do believe it grow in the Caribbean island as well. But as you know, guys, study the plant bitter duck and it will give you some idea of the benefit of the bitter duck plant the root have lots of benefits so do your research on bitter duck and get some idea of these different plants all right let's move on all right this also this is another herb that grows up in the garden that grows up all in the bushes you could go and find these herbs these plants these plants, I hope you guys can help me identify some of them. Okay. I don't know their name, but I'm acquainted with many of them. We have this one also. This one is a um, seed and a leaf. This is seed and a leaf. This grows in the Caribbean island as well. And it's also a coal hardy plant. Let's move on. This is a plant as well, guys. I need you guys to help identify this plant for me. This is a plant that pulled my attention. Look at the leaf. Look at the beauty of this plant. It always pulled my attention. I don't know what is this, but it pulled my attention. I'm hoping that someone will be able to identify this plant and give me some ideas that we can learn and understand what type of plant is this look at the leaf look at the leaf pretty well yes look at the leaf look at the body of the plant all right it's a small plant it have some big one too but this is a small one so i just want we to uh, try to identify please leave in the comment section if you knows anything about this plant let's move on so let's move on guys we look we're trying to identify plants that look you know sometimes you're walking and the plants them just dry your attention just pull pull your attention like this one right here this plant right here i don't know what type of plant it be but you know what it look like? It look like the leaf of this plant look like bay leaf. This leaf, let me see if I can smell this leaf. Oh my goodness. 
the smell of it smell like it gave you such a, a lemon scent my goodness oh wow guys look at this plant look at this plant look at this plant you see where it's growing from it's growing from way down here comes up look at the leaf of this plant it looks just like a bay leaf check it out look at the leaf it looks just like a bay leaf plant and the smell of it it smell just like bay leaf so now i have a plant home where i'm gonna pick i'm gonna take this few of this let me take a limb i'm gonna take a limb and i'm gonna take it home and i'm gonna grind it up with the other bay leaf i have just to identify to know if this is bay leaf but yes this plant is something the scent of this leaf look at the leaf the scent of this leaf tells you something is nowhere is nowhere guys the scent of this leaf tells me something mm -mm. all right okay this is what i'm telling you guys these strange plant does just dry your attention while you're walking is like there's a magnet inside them just dry your face your eyes onto them and then you cannot move your eyes until you go and try to figure them out okay I know for sure this one produces a beans, a berry. And the berry, you can actually eat the berry. I know that for sure. All right? But we actually looking for wild herbs in the wild. This leaf, you see this? This is a vines. This vines I don't know the name of this, but this is something as well. Let me smell it. Mmm. Uh-uh. Mmm. Wow. I got to do some research on this. I got to take a picture with this, and maybe I might have a better idea of what type of plant this is. But I know this plant. I recognize this plant from a young boy i recommend i recognize this plant and it's cold hardy so yes we know it also can grow in the caribbean island or all around the world it's cold hardy but check the leaf out guys maybe you guys might be able to help me identify these herbs as well and it's the place they just grow from and it's like nothing could stop them from growing wow this is amazing let's go again guys let's see what we can see while we're down here this is what i'm saying guys this is what i'm seeing these things draw your attention they pulls you like a magnet it's like they're telling you i'm here look at me why are you not looking at me I'm right here. This tree right here, this tree right here. This is a, oh man, I think it's a red dog something, but I can't remember the, the name. But I know for sure, people use the bark of this tree and make tea. I know for sure that people use the, look, that's the leaf right there. This tree, they use the bark and even the flowers from this tree, they use it and make tea as well. These are, oh man, these are the tree that produce the big white flowers. Oh man, I can't remember. But these, listen to me, man. And we in the wild, we in the wild, we in the wild. You see all this? All this is a big massive tree. You see this tree? Big massive tree that's going to be breaking down breaking down breaking down huge tree okay all 
right. This is amazing. I don't want to go too far today because I'm not prepared. I don't have all my water boots. I'm having on a slipper, so I don't want to go too far. But in this area here, I'm going to plant a few herbs right here. This is um, bee balm. This is bee balm that I'm going to be putting right here. Guys, this, this kind of soil is black gold. Then we have peppermint. So I'm going to put some mint right side it too. So that's some mint and with the other one, there's a next one. I guess that job, but that's two herbs I plant right there. No, there's another one I saw a while ago. There's one, there's a leaf they call wrong the wall. It's run like a vines, but the leaf of it is amazing. This leaf, let me smell this leaf. Mm -mm -mm. This smells like something. And look at it when it dry. So yes guys, as I know, show you guys, man. I hope you guys could help me identify these herbs that I show you. This is another tree here breaking down. Oh man. Yeah. I can't go no further to the guys. I'm prepared for this trip. But I'm gonna show you another vines, this vines. You see this one here? This one tells us something. This is another vines that pull my attention. Mm. The smell of this made me realize this smell like a plant we used to have. Check it out. Yes. So guys, thank you all to take this journey with me i hope you guys can help me identify some of these plants there's a lot more but we're gonna do it on our next journey all right okay There's a next one I want to show you guys. All right, I'm not going down in there right now, guys. I got to be more prepared. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share. Peace. All right, guys, this is another hub. I don't know the name, but what... Um.
All right. Thank you guys. Hope you guys enjoy.